Good morning, chicks and chickens. Welcome back to Old Man Farm. My name is Sid, as always. It's Martin's birthday, and I have uh, a very eventful day for my first day back to work after getting in the new house, and I'm going to share that with you. Also, I do have a couple of comments from yesterday's video, some pertaining to the war, some pertaining to batteries, and uh, at least one pertaining to a strange bun. So, uh, I'll get to those in a sec. Right now, I'm, I'm still coming off of the... Uh, I wouldn't say hype, I would say utter horror of getting home. Uh, remember yesterday when I said that uh, the dogs were adjusting at least a little bit? Yeah, that was a lie. Uh, well, at least for one of them. As I said, some of them are doing worse than others. Uh, Ollie, d d he did not have a good day. He, uh, he bent his cage um, enough that he was able to get out um, after he had already... Uh, pooped in his cage, and then proceeded to leave a string of poop through, like, three different rooms. Uh, and also ate an entire pack of King's Hawaiian rolls. So, that was his day. It was great. And then, after my shower, and, uh, I go to come upstairs to record, and I open the door to my upstairs, and it fell off the hinges, because apparently... Uh, they were not very well secured, so I had to sort of, um, you know, fix that. It's, it's sort of a quick fix for now till I have a day off and I can do something for real about it. Uh, and then also I came upstairs and there was just a window open. <laughs> just, you know, hey, window open. I know it's five degrees out, but this is, this is how we live now, so, uh, yeah. An eventful day for my first day back. Oh, you know what? I meant to make some uh, fences. We have to do that infinite spawner thing uh, that was told to us. Uh, but, you know, beyond that, they the other dogs did very well. He just... He's old. Now, Poke is older, but Poke is also... I mean, Poke used to live in a van. So, she is a little bit more chill when it comes to changing where she's currently living you know what i mean that's that's not um you know it's it's kind of whatever with her she has a initial anxiety but then she kind of gets over it but ollie uh not so much he's he's been having he's been having a time there we go she gave us a little bit of some infinite spawns i think i did that right i don't know we'll find out but, uh, well, actually, we got some comments from the same person who left us that infinite spawner technique, uh, about, well, batteries, and also, um, our talk about Kent and the army yesterday. Um, well, first off, it was mentioned, and we're actually, we're gonna go back and get started on this right now, it was mentioned that the best way to get batteries is just to make a bunch of uh, lightning rods and it was also mentioned in the comment that there is a way to get um, what do you call those uh, there is a way to get solar panels and I had actually I was reading up on um, I found that on the wiki while I was at work today and my uh, my exact response was well dip my tip and call me Achilles which I don't think is something Normal humans say, but uh, now that's in that's that's been said. That is in the human lexicon forever, uh, and you're welcome. So I'm gonna take some of this iron. Also, I realized we had a bunch of stones, so I wanted to put that in there. I'm gonna take. We're gonna use some of this iron. So we're gonna do one, two. Whoops. Come on, Sid. You know these buttons. Uh, here we go. One, two. We're gonna do eight total. Uh, and I'm really only basing that on we already have these four. Jeff, will you please move, dude? Come on. Please, Jeff. Oh, he really just, he really does always find a way to be exactly where I need to be. He's very, very good at that. Okay, well, we'll hold on to this one for now. Uh, but yeah, so also, like I said, we had a comment about the, um... The whole Kent situation, and uh, again, also, the 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 comment uh, quoted the wiki as saying that 
Kent is a soldier in the army of the Ferngill Republic, and he is a survivor of a Gotoro prison camp. So uh, that thought process, the, the prison camp thought process, is not unfounded. Um, whether or not that is 100% canon does it is a little bit nebulous because, uh, as was mentioned in the comment, it's not sourced, so not really sure if that's from the old uh, Concerned Ape himself, but there is a basis for believing that, so uh, yeah, I don't know, interesting. Now, I did not get a chance to check uh, into any mods that involve military. Again, not that I even think that I want to add it, but it was, it, it, I don't know, it's just something I was thinking about, and I do like to uh, be able to highlight mods um, that I think, whoops, we'll just take one of those, that I think could be interesting, even if uh, we're not necessarily going to use them. I mean, I have a lot of mods <laughs> installed that we're not using. Um, oh, and speaking of, obligatory... I'll say this again. Uh, all the mods are in the description, but there's also a nice, clean version version of it uh, on the Discord. So, if you're interested, you can check that out. But, okay, what are we looking at here? Uh, we'll get these cheeses. We'll head into town. Little foot, hello. We'll head into town here in a little bit, and we will um, we'll go hit up Martin. I wouldn't mind talking to him. I really do not associate much with him so it would be kind of nice to get some uh, couple of heart points in oh jesus there we go all right but we are going to go water our flowers first speaking of uh i know i didn't plant the rest of those sunflowers i will uh i forgot that we already had our hoe but i will uh try and pick some up when we run into town now, they're going to be all wonky, uh, and I'm not going to lie, I'm probably going to end up forgetting about them and heading to the island once everything else is grown. But, uh, you know, hey, it's the thought that counts, right? All right. So, uh, as I said, this is my first day back to work um, since moving, and it's... It's a bit longer of a drive than I'm used to. It's about a 35-minute drive, whereas it used to be about a 7-minute drive before. So, yeah, significant difference. But uh, it's it's a leisurely drive. It's it's really not so bad. So um, I don't think it's... I don't know. I don't think it's going to, like, really, really, really grind on me uh, as I wasn't sure. I, I don't... I don't like having to... Spend uh, a very long time in the car. I don't like long commutes is what I'm getting. That's what I'm trying to say. I am not a fan of long commutes. Um, I, you know, I'm like, okay, if I'm already going to be spending so much time at work, I really do not want to be spending time getting to work. Um, but, I mean, what are you going to do, right? Like, I, I, we've talked about this. I have a decent job. I like the hours. So... It's worth driving for, I guess, is what I'm getting at. Okay, let's sell a few things. We will try and age those. Uh, okay, we'll see if we have a spot to age them. But I want to go find Martin. Do do. Oh, and you know what else I really want to check is Grandpa's shed. Hardwood. St we need 600 stone. Oh my God, I was thinking it was like. 300 okay iron bars 50 battery packs 20 yeah we just we need to go mining and you know whatever we need the stone and we need actually you know what no it's fine it's fine we'll do we'll do a little bit of mining today but i'm not going to get too crazy about it now where does martin hang out this time of day who is that who are you oh that's sandy cavern north up here is, is best best worth avoiding I've never, I've never seen her outside of the, that's crazy. I've never seen her outside of the desert. Sorry, I'm really struggling for words here. Okay, where does Martin, where does Martin even live? Um, 
Hmm. I get it. Because this is Victor's house, isn't it? Because, yeah, this is Victor's house. They're not, like, brothers, are they? No, but it looks like Sophia's over. Let's go say hi to these guys. Hello, Victor. You giving this to me? This is great. Thank you, Senor Gooey. Oh, that's gross. My villain academia is so cool. Oh. <laughs> they really tried hard to uh, plant that name in there. You know what? I think Martin might work at Joja Mart. Let's go check that out. Hello, George. Oh, right. George from Joja Mart's terminated. Um. God, we have so many villagers. This is awesome. I love this. Uh, I am gonna price just for the hell of it. Iron ore. Oof, it is not cheap. Not that we can't, but 50 bars worth? Ugh, I don't know if that's really worth it. Martin. Martini. Alright, I have no idea where he is. Man, that sucks. I, I, I don't even know where he lives. I feel really bad about that. Because he, he is an SVE person, right? Well, I guess it's Saturday. Maybe we'll find him at the star drop. I guess it's a little early, but we'll, uh, we'll put off going to the, uh, what you job it. The cave. We'll put off mining for a day, and it is what it is. Here you go, Kent. Hey, this is a really great gift. Thanks. Oh, look, she she loves truffles and goat cheese. Let's give her a goat cheese. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted. Thank you. You're welcome, Leah. Yeah, I go to the beach a lot during the summer. Of course, you can join me. Don't be shy. Oh, okay, Leah. Uh, no, we won't ask her for <laughs> uh, How? Where are we at with Leah? Out of curiosity. Uh, not quite full hearts. Getting there, though. Oh, sorry, Gus. It's not Gus, Sid. It's Clint. <laughs> you do this every time. All right. Is Sandy going to the... What is up with Sandy coming to town? I swear I did not... I never knew this. I never knew this. Hey, Trini. A horse actually chased a dog on Marnie's farm yesterday. Oh, no. <laughs> Can't be having that. This is really bumming me out that I can't think of where Martin lives. I mean, that's all the houses, isn't it? Right? I gotta look at the map. I'm... I'm all messed up here. Okay, well, anything new doesn't seem to have a, uh, a mouse over um, name. And you know what? If it's 7 p.m. and he's not here, I just, I don't think he's going to be here. But where the hell does he... I don't know. I don't know. It is what it is. Sorry, Martin. I tried. <laughs> I tried, aka I hung outside the bar all day and you never showed up. Yeah, not at the clinic. Well, I don't know. I don't know feel like a heel about it, but what are you going to do? Uh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to go mine just, just ever so briefly. Uh, where would we find iron? Pretty low, right? Mm, let's just go to 100. Oh, wait, I forgot. This is, we're going to find gold here. Oh, that was a good song, too. You know what? If we don't get it, if we don't get that same song, or, or rather, if we don't get music, I will edit in that song again. Here we go. There's some iron ore right off the rip. Oh, there's quite a bit. Okay, this was already worth the trip. I'm glad we came down here. Now, I really want to get this Grandpa's Shed thing going. Like I said, I keep forgetting about it because I am... As most of you know, I am just the most forgetful person on the planet. 
um, thank you concussions and alcohol abuse, but I, uh, I really want to, I want to see what happens with it. You know, it's because it's an SVE related thing. I have obviously never, I've never experienced it. So I mean, there's at that aspect of it, but also it does allow us to expand our, uh, like our product aging, you know, specifically our wine, I guess is the one I'm most worried about. Um, hmm. You know, I'll have to check, but I'm wondering if maybe, hmm, maybe like 60 through 70 would be a better, oh, or is, I was wondering if because this looked though its way, if maybe we weren't going to get enough, enough iron, but I think it might be because it's a, uh, it's, yeah, it's one of these skull attack levels. Hmm. I'm not sure. I, I don't know. I'm not very good in the mine, obviously. I mean, you see this. I, I just get destroyed. I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, oh, there we go. Omni geodes. Those are nice. Now, I'm wondering, though, can I exploit this and just, like, keep go? Whoops. That's not what I wanted. Can I exploit that and just keep going back to, like, number 70? Try six. Okay. So 65 is still in the snow, and I feel like the snow and ice caverns are the ones I'm going to find more iron at. He says in, in the floor that has literally zero iron available. Oh, nice. Yeah, may as well get these things. I mean, ore is ore, you know? Sorry, soot sprites. Let's, let's go ahead and look around before we just dip. Because iron ore is... There we go. Ooh, nice. Is that aquamarine? Sure is. Okay, we're getting real close. I'm going to get this iron ore, and then we'll get out of here. Ah, crap. There's another one. I'll get that one, too. We can make it. Um, and I guess what we'll have to do tomorrow is... Oh, I forgot to get those damned... Um, I forgot to get those damned sunflower seeds. We'll have to just make a... Uh, what do you call that? Uh, a warp. We'll have to get a, a good old warp whistle back home. Uh, bus stop... And there, look, we don't have to leave Grover behind, and we still get our fast travel. Just hand in Montana this, you know? Uh, but I don't think I'm really gonna have... Ugh, can I sort through these things? Well, we might be able to. Quick sorting montage. All right, we got through most of that stuff. I know that artifact's worth nothing, but like, what am I gonna do? I'm gonna hold on to it. It doesn't. It doesn't do me any good to hold on to either. So get this placed, and here's hoping for a storm tomorrow, because uh, I believe that was like 15 of them, right? Should have been. And uh, we only need 20 total. So, that, oops, wrong item. Here we go. Let's go ahead and check. Clear and sunny. Damn it. Well, that's okay. It'll happen eventually. But I feel bad about not being able to find Martin. Uh, I should I should probably look up where he lives. That's odd. Well, anyway. Uh, it was a very eventful real-life day. <laughs> and kind of a confusing in-game day. But either way, as always, be good to each other. I will talk to you tomorrow. And good night.